Now, the next time this comes up is 1971. Here's a letter to John Milner. So far as you're taking initiation from Brahmananda Maharaj, I have no objection. Uh, you've got pretty punitive damages here. Just underneath this one. Yeah, we'll just put this to the side for now. Thank you. So far as you're taking initiation from Brahman under Marsh, I have no objection. But it is the etiquette that in the presence of one spiritual master, one does not accept disciples. In this connection, Swami Brahmananda may write to me and I will instruct him. Yeah. <laughs> now we move on down the line to 1972. Apparently things have looked up a little bit for Chutananda Marsh. <laughs> Prabhupada says, Some time ago, you asked my permission for accepting some disciples. Now the time is approaching very soon when you will have many disciples by your strong preaching work. Stick to the line of our strong preaching method and many misguided persons will be blessed by your proper guiding. And then we come to 1974. In 1974, some interesting things started happening. Some of our god brothers began jumping the gun. We found pictures appearing on altars in New Vrindavan of Kirtanananda Swami. We found uh, pictures of Hansadutta Swami in Germany. And this resulted in a conversation which I haven't found anywhere, but which I think some of you will remember, where Prabhupada begins, now there is some tendency in our society to become guru. Long silence. And what Srila Prabhupada goes on to say is essentially what's here uh, in this letter to Hansa Dutta, dated October 1st, 1974. I have heard that there is some worship of yourself by the other devotees. Of course, it is proper to offer obeisances to a Vaishnava, but not in the presence of the spiritual master. After the departure of the spiritual master, it will come to that stage. But now, wait. Otherwise, it will create factions. Now, the final quotation is one that I'd like to give from 1975, which is pretty well along, considerably after uh, various people had been empowered to initiate on beads and perform fire sacrifices and so on. And that's the quotation that is here on the board. It's to one devotee, Tusta Krishna Maharaj. Prabhupada says, yeah, go ahead. There is a matter of etiquette, he says. You can bring it yeah. forward. There is a matter of etiquette. It is the custom that during the lifetime of your spiritual master, you bring the prospective disciples to him. And in his absence or disappearance, you can accept disciples without any limitation. This is the law of disciplic succession. <laughs> 